I will ask you simple questions. You will answer in short sentences only what you believe to be absolute truth. Absolute truth. I can do that. Now, brief as you can, what is your name? Stanton Carlisle. Nightmare Alley is a tale about destiny, about a character that could change his life, and yet his own hubris is so strong that it becomes destiny. It's about a man who is finding himself through the world of a traveling carnival and all the people that come with it. Folks here, they don't make no never mind who you are or what you've done. My character takes him in even though he recognizes there's something not right about this guy. This guy's a little off. Everybody comes to this thing with a different kind of life that they either are running away from or had enough of. The problem with Stanton Carlisle is that he's, he's not meant to fit in. The carnival world is a magnet for that type of person who doesn't feel that they really belong anywhere else. No man can outrun God, Stan. They're vulnerable people, but just some very human relationships that are explored in this world. Molly, you're bigger in this place. If you let me, I want to give you the world and everything in it. And the film exists in two quite distinct worlds, the world of a carnival and then a polite society. The darkness that exists in that real world is actually far more threatening and terrifying. Doctor, you run a wreck, same as me. The city is a ruthless place. People that are cracked inside and are incapable of seeing the good in themselves and others. I've given you a fortune! People use people. People destroy people. People with faults, that's what we are. We're not perfect. And Guillermo's not afraid to create pain and flaws. It's what makes it interesting. We can make quite a big dent in this town. Nightmare Alley is a dark night of the soul, and it's driven at center by Stan's unrelenting desire to get to the top at whatever cost. I know you're no good, and I know that because neither am I.